G'day guys, my name's Josh, you can call me Shawoodle, and welcome back to my Caribbean paradise, and what a view to wake up to, where I am back in survival, fountain of youth. After a lot of arduous journeys and hard yak yesterday, I have managed to climb the big cartography tree and map out my local area. And more importantly, I think, well, you can't really see it now because it's daylight, I could see a couple of flutterings of a couple of uh, glowy bugs all around the place, one of which is supposed to signify where that looking glass is, where the big magnification goggles from Old Mate Skip is currently hiding out, which was just... Over there, not that you can really, I, can, I can't really like get a cursor or anything out. Over there, <laughs> on the beach where in the general direction I'm looking at, over on that furthest palm tree, that is where a cluster of, uh, of fireflies were all fluttering about. So if I go out there, hopefully that's where it's going to be. That's where the map said I should be going at the very least. There's also a little spit of rock over there with like some sort of emblem on it. But also, I need to go back, climb that giant cartography tree over there, fill up that part of the map, but I also need to... One of the things that I noticed when I was editing the last episodes is occasionally things will pop up saying I had a skill point that I just learned, and I haven't done anything about it. Look, perk points. Got two, so I can start actually building out my survivor just like every RPG ever. I can resist poisons, resist diseases, concentration, unlocks... Ooh, is that like... I can go full Etsy, I get like my eagle vision, like slow down time. In this mode, special objects are, yeah, it is like eagle vision, not slow down time wise. Uh, special objects, weapons, ammo, and dropped bags are highlighted. That does sound pretty important, but I'll make sure I check over everything before I start spending points all frivolously. The only ones that are really interesting to me are either alchemy, which will unlock, oh sorry, alchemistry? I'm pretty sure it's alchemy, but, you know, I've been wrong before, so I'll trust the game. Is uh, Alchemistry, uh, which unlocks the Buffalo Potion recipe. No idea what that does, but kind of tempting. Learning, which means I can get skill points faster, which just seems like a good investment to me. Or that Concentration one. I do have a really bad habit of occasionally... Ooh, actually, all better sleep. For better... Ooh, for better energy recovery. You know what? I'm just going to trust me gut. I'm going to buy you. Thank you. And I'm going to buy you. Thank you. There goes all my points. Ooh, there's extra stuff to unlock as well. Make palm... Make a palm juice collector? So that will sort... Ooh, okay. That'll sort out my need to go and eat coconuts all day. Coconut rainwater collector. Oh, these are tasks. These are tasks or things to do. I can... Okay. Okay. Some goals, make some walls, make a chemistry workbench, mushroom soup, sounds gross, but okay. All right, there's a whole lot more to this game than I gave it credit for in the first episode, but that's right, I'm learning now. Speaking of learning, let's get down the scary ass ladder all the way to the bottom and go and check out where that spyglass should be. Over there, we're off and running. I did also, ooh, there's another, there's another Franklin out over here and a couple of scuttler crabs. All right, hold on. Uh, I don't have a better way to murder you right now, so it's gonna have to be a little bit brutal. Oh, I don't like the squeal. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, I'm sorry, Frank. I didn't want it to go down like that, but I need your shell to make myself a water bottle. I did also, uh, in the last episode, I think future editing Josh is still doing this, get all the icons moving behind my face cam and put them, like, just over there on the other side so you can see, like, all of the, the, de the buffs and debuffs that I'll likely have going on all the bloody time. You've just got meat and no shell? I beg to differ. There's definitely a shell on you. My stone cutter is already cooked. Hold on a second. Let me just make a new one. I'm running out of tools so quickly. This is actually the spot where I thought I saw the fireflies because there's a little rock spit just there. And there doesn't lose a whole lot here, but I'm also real cucumbered right now. I'm going to quickly go... Oh, I see a big pebble up on the rock over there. I now know that rocks are so bloody valuable. I need them all the bloody time. I'm going to quickly grab campfire with stones or... Nah, yeah, just a normal little campfire will do me. I need a couple of twigs, though. Hold your horses. Because I've got a bunch of turtle meat. I've got a bunch of eggs and stuff like that that I also need to whip up. If I'm cucumbered at the moment, I'm weighed down by all my gubbins. I need some twigs, please. Then I may as well cook it all up and just be done with it. Uh, look, none of you are really helping me, so give me all your leaves, and I'm going to be really destructive. Cut you down. All right, the gods are mad about that. That's all right. You come with me, please. Oh, it's like I'm playing the forest all over again. Can I turn you into twigs? I'm going to throw my axe, crafting. Can I, like, chop you up into itty-bitty bits? Surely. Surely. Long stick. 
Common log. I can't make. I can't make sure. So I do need long sticks though for spears. I need a saw. Now oh, shit. Now I've just broken down nature for no reason. That's just wasteful. I even tried just like slicing up with my axe, but that's no luck either. All right. Never mind then. I guess I'll just be cucumbered for a little bit and see if I can find anything. You, please come with me. Oh, I'm. No, oh, now I'm really cucumbered. All right. I need to. I need to reevaluate some things. What can I get rid of? I've got some worms. My eggs are almost spoiled, so I need to get those cooking nice and quickly. Got a couple of stones, which I need. A piece is a piece of even Jatoba gum. So that's just Tinder. All right, fair enough. I've got my one Liana rubber. I need to save that for when I go and um climb the next tree. Can I gobble some coconuts then? That might help me for up some weight. No, I'm still knackered. Damn it, I don't want to throw anything away. I didn't want it to come to this, but I'm just chucking some stuff on the ground there in the hope that I can find some things. I'm still cucumbered though. Uh, I can find some sticks to make myself a fire so I can get this going. You, sure, drink one of those. Chuck the rest of you down. That one soon. All right, everything please stay there. I have no idea what the despawn time is going to be, but I don't want to lose any of you. I need five sticks. I need five sticks and for, for it to also stop raining. Kind of hard to get a campfire going when it's bucketing down cats and dogs and various other fuzzy things. I've come back with all of my sticks and all of my gubs are still hanging out on the rock over here. So I'll take all of you back. I'm going to be completely banana, but that's okay with me. Crafting. Where did you go? Campfire. I don't really like having to scroll through this menu every time, but I'm getting used to it. <laughs> Somewhat, somehow. There you are. Campfire. Place you. Sure, that will do. Cooking whack in all of that. Get your built. At some point, the rain might stop, but not just yet. I did say I can now make myself the canopy, but it will use the very last of my rope, which I need to go and scale one of those big trees over there. So I can't be wasteful with that. I'm just going to have to wait for the rain to stop, I suppose, and just hope for the best. It's getting dark enough that the fireflies are starting to come back again. See what I mean? That's what drew me out here in the first place. After putting myself a bed and a campfire, I can now move a little bit again. So... <gasps> it was the right spot. It's right bloody there. Columbus's spyglass. Give me that little slice of hotness. Yes, bloody please. View from the mountain. Okay, well, I don't know what. There's a lot of mountains. Gonna be more specific than that, there, champion. Can I? Can I just use your willy nilly? How do I? How do I use? Where'd you go? Where are you? I just. I want to. I want to play with my looking glass. How do I do it? Maybe I just need to go like back up the trees. Maybe it gives me like an expanded map uh, from what it was before. Because before when I went up the tree, it only gave me a couple hundred meters in radius, or sorry, in circumference rather, uh, of how far I could jot down on the map. But maybe if I have the spyglass, I can see a little bit further and potentially map out some more stuff. Fishing stand, start fishing. I have worms, I don't have a rod. I left it back on the boats out the bottom of the ocean. 0% chance to catch fish. Probably because I have no rod. All right, well, fair enough then. Look at him down there. You guys are lucky you get to swim another day, but I'll come back for him. But can I make one? I assume a fish rod needs a long stick, and I definitely don't have one of those. I'm just going to try and sleep for a little bit because it's way too damp out here for me to actually get any rests. Nope, slept an hour. It's still raining. Sleep another hour. No longer raining. Okay, good. That means I can finally light you, get you up and going, cook up some stuff. More importantly, get some extra energy back. If it was, yeah, it's actually pretty cooked at the moment. Get some energy back when I do go back to sleep. Get your sizzling. Lovely. Immediately. Can I quickly fry up some eggs that I've been holding for ages? That was definitely a thing, wasn't it? Have I completely gapped it? Roasted fish. No, I, I have eggs and they're still relatively good. Blueprints. Fried egg, I need breadfruits. Okay, look, in that case then, I just, I'm, you gotta spoil before I can do anything with you anyway. So I was gonna throw all these eggs on the ground. There you go, if there's like a, oh my goodness. If there's an over wrapped around here or something, then they're gonna have an absolute freaking banquet. That's enough eggs to feed Homer Simpson breakfast or Ron Swanson. We've got some bacon around here somewhere. Given all the boars out there, you probably could. Uh, right, I'm still cucumbered though, so. What else can I do with you? Is there anything I can actually cook? I can... Oh, yeah, okay. I was going to say, I've got a fair amount of uh, turtle meat on me. That used up a lot of my night time, though, so I wouldn't need to go back to sleep. Yes, I know you're knackered. Hold on. Hold on. Here. Have a nap. Let's sleep in a little bit as well. Let's go, like, five hours next to the campfire. 
gave me a good bit of stamina back, but not a whole lot. We're trying. We're trying our best. I'm leaving a whole bunch of my stuff behind. The bird of paradise flower, all of my lovely purple berries, which I really wish I could take with me, but it weighs me down. And they don't, I mean, they're just food or edible can gather from uh, akako trees. They're just food, so that's all right. That can stay there. I'm already completely hydrated and well nourished, so we're all good and gravy then. G'day, crab. Catch you later, crab. Go and nibble on a coconut instead. I'm going to go back to the tree, see if I can climb and explore more with the telescope. But if not, there's that real big bad boy just on the cliff over there that's got my name written all over it. Like once upon a time, I carved my name in the bark over and over and over again, which is really bad to do. Don't do that. I'm back up top on the sketchy ass branch. Open my map. So does this give me any extra range? I guess we'll find out. Map you up. It did. It gave me a little bit of extra. Interesting sight. Oh, some long sticks. I'm in desperate need of some of those. Chronicles. Algebra. It's too close to algebra. And that's scary enough as it is already. I really didn't go very far at all, though, did it? A little bit of extra, but not that much. Harpy respawns in nine days because I may have accidentally murdered one. Interesting sight. I think that's the mountain I have to climb to go and explore more. But those long sticks, that's what I need. The rest of this stuff, there's no... There's no rope plants around here, is there? No, not really. Okay, well, in that case, that's where I'm going. Can I mark it or something? Oh, no. It's just like, it's just over there somewhere, I think. Yeah, I'm looking straight at it. Over near the short eared dog and the chooks. All right, I'm coming. Are these the things that give me the long sticks? It sounds like there's a honey badger in here somewhere. Yeah, there you are. G'day, champ. Oh, I'm going to bonk your nog. How you doing, hot stuff? Oh, ah, oh, I'm doing less good. Stop it. Stop it, you angry little morsel. Get the ship back over here. Bonk you again. Strength got leveled up. Come with me, please. It hasn't weighed me down. That's all fine. All right, I need all of the sticks, please, because I'm so desperate for them every other time to leave anything behind. Plus, I've been keeping my old broken tools. I dropped one before, but that's okay. Purely because in here somewhere... Not that one. Where are you? In the weapons. This one, Stone Spear. <gasps> It's gonna use my rope, though. I still think it's worthwhile. I think it's worthwhile. I'll throw my kind of okay one on the ground. You, real quick, make me... Where were you? That one. Crafts. Needs a regular workbench. How do I make a workbench? With more long sticks, a rope and a small stick. All right, well, shit, I... Oh, man, I'm so cucumber. I've got so much stuff on me. You ate one and a half kegs. I'm six kilos over the limit. Ah, oh, that's not good. That's not good at all. I don't, I don't want to leave anything behind, though. Maybe I build a box and just come back for it later. I think I need to change some of the way that I do things here. I keep breaking down campfires and bedrolls and stuff like that and forgetting how to bloody find them again because I can't find anything in here. You. Pretty uh, bedroll. You. Uh, you can just go like that. Place all of that. I have zero leaves. Hold on. I have plenty of them. One, two, three, four, five... Jolt, close enough. Chuck you in them. By the time I build all the stuff that I need to go to sleep, it's daytime again. So, you know what? We're just going to sleep all the way through. Can I sleep a full 24 hours? I... Oh, I can. I can. I kind of want to, you know? I kind of want to. All right, let's get ourselves snacked up and ready to go. Quickly grab... In fact, you. Just give me, like, one hour of sleep. So I have a little bit of stone. I won't hurt myself again by crafting up some coconuts. You... Whip up one of those so I can have a little sip. Thank you very much. I'm going to go full sleepy boy. Where are you? Where are you? You. No, don't drop it, you muppet. You. Put it in your face instead. Nom. And nom. All right. Let's go. <laughs> this is so dumb. All the way to there. Yeah, no. Short one on. I'll do that. It's now raining, but that's okay. I am max energy, which means I can harvest up all of my big sticks from around here. So once I'm done with that, I can go back to sleep again, get through to tomorrow morning, and then take off back home. Genius! Napping is always the best. I did mildly hurt myself getting all my big sticks, but that's okay because I've got bulk of them now and I'm feeling really bloody good about myself. Uh, crafting. Need to make you in the campfire. Hold on. One of those, please. I need a couple of wide leafies. You and you. In fact, let's make... Two of you. Normally, this is a silly thing for me to be doing, but I'll try and make what I can anyway. I need an extra leaf out of you. Thank you. Make two of these. Thank you very much. Whip you up. It's now raining. That's okay. You slap you on. 
I'm nice and healed. I'm nice and good. All right, let's sleep till... I was going to say tomorrow morning, but I think it's morning time. I worked all through the night. All right, happy as Larry. Let's grab the heaviest... Well, not the heaviest things, but the most important things I can out of here. You, in me face. You, in me face. You guys weigh a little bit as well, don't you? Let's just eat the honey badger and we'll keep some roasted turtle for later. There's my big sticks there. Going to quickly craft up. Yeah, I do want a spear. I do definitely want a spear because it's a long way home and I don't want to die on the way. So my weight limit is 50.6 and I'm right on the cusp. I can still climb the sprint. I'm not especially light on my feet, but that's okay. You guys just stay here. I'll come back another time. Hope I remember where it is. In the long stick forest, we'll call that. All right. Yep, there's eagles all over the shop. There's chooks clucking about, but I want to go all the way back that way. It, di it did say, like, my mission is to go get a view from the mountain, which I assume is that. It's the only mountain I can see, and I think I did see a little pathway up, but I think a better option for me at the moment is to get back to... I was going to say my base. I don't really have a base at all, do I? I could just build... I could live in the snake den. I mean, why am I going all the way back over there? Yes, there are some liana trees, some places to get myself some more rope, but I mean, there's shelter already here. I can build my own, but I can't do that just yet. Maybe living in a snake hole isn't the worst idea. Yeah, let's not be silly. Let's not be daft. I've got Dopai's artwork on the wall. I've got a nice view out to the ocean, which is where the cannon fire of our friendly ships were, so that's probably a good idea. And an already little slot ready for my campfire. Uh-oh, I am hearing the drums of war, though. The harpies are back. That's fine. I'm not particularly scared of you this time because I've got a long and mildly pointy stick. There you are. There you are. Come on. Come this way, please, and I'll pluck you dry. Come and get plucked by the bird up. Wait. Where are you going? Where are you going? All right, apparently harsh language will sort out all these problems. It may be mighty presumptuous of me, but I'm just going to chuck everything I have into you, go and get the rest of my governs and move it up to him. That's, 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 you know what? Sometimes when things don't really go in your way, which if yesterday taught us anything, they're definitely not of late. Sometimes you just got to do what you got to do and make the best of it. Oh. Is someone mad at me again? They shouldn't be. I'm just coming back to get all of my own stuff. You, please give me all of you. Thank you. And instead of breaking this down and taking it with me, I'm going to go G for change. Space to move and just run it back myself rather than building it all over again. Save myself the time and just run back and forth. Which seems like the longer option, but it seems to work okay. I've got my campfire, but it's only like a, like a low level one. And if I'm going to live in here for more than five seconds, I'm going to break you down and instead give me a couple of the rocks that are so bleeding valuable to me and whip up a proper campfire. Oh, actually, while I'm in here, now I've got like something resembling a home. I need more Liana ropes, so that's going to be my mission for today, as it kind of was yesterday, but I actually have an idea of where to go this time. Grab you. Oh, please fit. Please fit. No, I just... I broke down a campfire in the middle of you a second ago. That's... A, that's... That's annoying. That would have been perfect. Surely. Please. Okay, if there's a millimeter where you're going to actually fit in there, I'd love it. I've never had something so big trying to fit in something so small. This is completely unnatural for me. How does this ever work? That's going to annoy me forever that I couldn't fit it in there, but I had to just find something to do. I think the stoned uh, fire lasts longer if it's got like the, the protection around it, even though those were there, that has to actually count, so moved over to that one instead. Alright. I'm still a little bit damp, and that's okay. I'm oh, I'm not going to bother lighting the fire for you, actually, because I don't want to waste my time. It's halfway through the day. Okay, I'm going to put the rest of this stuff away then. Place all. I'm going to need my one rope. You come with me, my treasure that you are. Gross, rotten food, I think. Ooh, so I can't actually use you for some things, but it will absolutely give me the trot. So I'm going to stay away from that. I'm going to need my mapping charcoal. Wherever you've gone, take both of you. Yep, sure. I'll take my axe. I'll take my mostly broken cutter. The rest of the actual broken ones can stay there. You can all hang out for a little bit. I reckon we're okay. I reckon we're about as good as we're ever going to be. All right. Let's go try and climb that big ass tree again and hopefully find some more rope plants. I really like that though. I like that I can take advantage of my environment. It's kind of like living in a POI in seven days, but there's actual like reason to do it. I can cut you down for some extra small sticks. Now I'll keep that in mind for later. You guys give me some extra long sticks. Oh. 
<laughs> I've been here before. Okay, I'm going to quickly just whip you down. Take all that. Only takes 10 minutes. That's fine. Whip you. No, not that one. Sorry. Not that one. G arm. 10 minutes as well. Whip you down soon. All right. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Stumble across the remnants of my own muppetry. Yeah, I like that there's actually a benefit to having some decent shelter, like your stamina region and stuff like that. It makes sense, and I like it. I like you get a benefit for moving into what used to be someone else's house, or a temple or something. I might be desecrating something, but look, man's got to sleep. I'm trying to maintain my life as the speediest boy that ever did live. Oh, I've run right next to a harpy nest. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Are you crank with me? I did get a little bit close to you, chicks. I can't really blame you. It's getting real dark out here as well. Let's get into the forest. Oh, it's even darker again. Uh, are you a road? You look like a road. Hopefully, you will lead me to the map tree or straight into the jaws of something very hungry and angry. Uh, I mean, I get angry when I'm hungry, so I can't really blame it. Oh, that's a thistle. Mind that. And a roadblock of thorns. All right. And we're going to like just... Uh, oh. Yep, excuse me, excuse me. Just like weave my way through. Nice, lovely. Another big tablet. Oh, another stone head. I've already read you. I've been here before. All right, that's fine. So the big ass tree should be just up here. There it is. Nice. Here we are. Watch out for snakes, please. Cartographer's tree. Place ladder. I can hear the sizzle of a serpent. Oh, I've... Oh my god, it teleported me to the other side where the snakes are. Alright, that's a little bit sketch open. Alright then. Pretty genuine question mark on that, but I'll try to put it behind me. Nice. Okay. Up the tree. Uh. Harpy nest. Do you include a harpy or can I just raid you with no real uh consequences? I hate consequences. There we go. Done. You are kind of right in the way though. I need to be able to map this place and you're right blocking me view. What about this side? Up we go, up we go, up we go. Ha. Oh. oh my god, almost fell. Look at this, though. How could you not love this? Oh, another tree over there. I'm above where the eagles dam. Nice. You. Map. I can map 466 meters. Absolutely. Lulu, give me all that. Oh, ha, ha, ha. Give me all that info. Special objects. There's shit everywhere. Fuck yeah. So what I need... Oh, yes. Thank you. There's a couple of yarn trees just neck door. Bread tree. Actually, I needed that to make... Whatever it was. I needed bread for something. But that is the juiciest bit of the lot. There's actually a couple out that way as well. Although that's... Oh, yeah. Okay. That's like in the bottom part of the forest. That's fine. So I'll go and grab this. I'll go and grab that. I might even head back to my original bed all the way back over there to have a cheeky kick because it's about to be night. So in fact, it's the middle of the night now. That might be a pretty wise move and there should be some more Liana up by the other honey badges. Oh, look at it. It's everywhere. This is so good. I love how this map system works. It's so good. I got down the bottom of the tree and it's absolutely dark down here. I can't see a bleeding sausage even though it's in the car park of a Bunnings. So I'm going to try and find if there's any place I can... Try and find a place to chuck down a cheeky bedroll and have a nap. I'm reasonably well uh, sorted on all of my stats. Can you just go down somewhere here, please? Come on, this is close enough to the ground. I am on the ground. Let me sleep. There we go. I had a nap. It's now morning time. Look at that lovely sunrise through there. I could not see anything last night. And if I can't see anything, neither could you guys. So I had to make sure I skipped ahead. Take you. Break all of that. I need a couple of drips of water. My stamina is still pretty cooked as well, but that's fine. Big branches, Liana. That's where I'm headed. It's over, um, like, the direct other side of the tree. All right, that's fine. Let's go follow what this bush actually looks like. We're finally on the right track. Oh, you look... Oh, hold on a second. I see you. Yep. Hold on. Let me just go... Yep. Like that. Stick you with a big old needle. Take that back again. Thank you. And then take your rattle. I mean, look, it looks like fun to shake it all around a bit. This is a very viney tree. So surely you... Yes, a bunyip tree with vine. <gasps> and you give me 10. You give me 10 of the best. Although my axe is completely knackered. Uh, hold on a second. Can I make a new one? No, because I don't have the tools to do it. Shit. Shit. I came all this way and I can't get the rope. Damn it, Axe. Live a little longer, would ya? Oh, that's okay. That's okay. I found myself a big boulder, and we know that the big boulders can get turned into little pebbles. You make one of those. Thank you very much. I can then repair you. 
Don't throw it, your pelican. That one, repair. Yes, please. 20 minutes. Jeez, the day gets by. I was going to surely not. It's not night time already. No, it's just gone overcast and very bleeding dark. That's all right, though. I have my axe and I have the bunyip tree. Wherever it's gone. Uh-oh. I'm all lost. I'm all lost and turned around. I've gone past it. It's back over this way. Thank God for maps. There you are. There you are. Give me all that you are. Ten ropey goodnesses. Thank goodness for that. Now I'm curious though. This is where I found the big rock. Is there is there more here? There's lots of ooh, lots of remnants of things gone by. With the drawing of a bull. All right, the Book of Saint Albans. Time for a cheeky read, I reckon. You, Book of Saint Albans. Where are you? Not Columbus's spyglass. That's super bloody handy. Increases range by 25%. I was right in my assumptions before. Where's... Where's the book? Where's the book? I got the book. I found the book. Tell me the book. What? Why can't I read it? There's an ancient ark. What do you do? Snake potion? Native medicine made from living water temporarily holds consumption of food, water, and energy. So it's like... It's like power thirst. All right, nice. I'll take you. Thank you for that one. Oh, I am actually... I got... I got nibbled by something. Actually, I'm reading that. So chance recovery, 30%. So the 30% chance it gets better and a 28% chance it gets worse. Oh, I didn't realize it could just heal on its own, but all right, that seems lovely to me. All right, sick as. Anything else that's kind of fun around here doesn't really look like it. Let's go grab ourselves some more rope and then... Start heading back to civil well, sorry, civilization to where I put down some leaves I can sleep on and sleep the night away. That looks like me viney tree friend. I heard ya. I heard ya. I can barely see ya. It gets real dim in the jungle, but you're gone. You can hear one of your friends as well. Just look for the big wide gaping mouth to feed my long stick to. Nice. There you go. Put you down. Make sure you guys don't go to waste though. Take your little rattles. My stone cutter is absolutely cooked. All right, fair enough. Then I won't take you. And my axe is cooked as well. All I've done is cut down the last freaking tree. Mm, that's annoying. All right, whatever. So each time I take all my rope, I've got to... Ah, spider! Or sc scorpion or something interrupting me harvesting. Can you not, please? Oh, Jesus, creepy crawlies everywhere. Creepy crawlies everywhere. I hate the freaking jungle. This is why I don't go outside. I'm trying to find. Hopefully it's in here somewhere. No, not you. Not you. That's the bird of paradise plant. All right, that's fine. There's a Brit. Oh, I heard a rustling. I heard a rustling. I've been sitting around, but it's too dark for me to see. I thought there was a bread tree around here, around here somewhere. It says so on this as I'm looking... Yeah, you're doing combo. This is looking directly at it. So, you? No? Oh, bread tree. Here we go. E. Take all. Unlocking some more recipes. Always a good time. All right, I might have over summer welcome a little bit. I want to head back to my little paradise on the beach all the way back out here. It's a long way to go, but uh, what's the time, actually? It's getting kind of late at night. I might be able to make the run. Mm, yeah, all my stuff's out there. That's where I need to go to. All right, we're... Which way am I headed? Face the wrong direction. That's the right. I might try and grab up the yard on the way through as well. All right, let's get trotting. Oh, finally out of the jungle. I can finally see wherever the heck I am. All right, where's this? On the right-hand side, a pecari. So is a pecari just a tiny pig? Have I been calling everything a boar, but the boar's the real big scary things, and the pecari is just a tiny little morsel of bacon? I'm more than interested to go and have a quick little gander at you and see what the go is. <gasps> and a banana palm. I want a banana. Oh, it's getting real dark again. All right, hold on. We'll just have a quick little squeeze about. Is there any any stones or anything for me? Doesn't really look like much. Where's the where's the bananas? You're holding out at me, Jeffrey. Where's the bloody bananas? You? <gasps> banana. Take all of you. Yes, please. Green banana, yellow banana, white banana. I don't really mind too much. Just give me all of them. All of my banana harvesting has made it turn to night time. Just get your crouch on and nice and so... Oh, that scared the shit out of me. Old mate, Jordan. Jordan's are infectious. Please keep that to yourself there, old mates. You. There we go. Harvest you. I know you're hurt. I don't care. No sympathy. You just got to get yourself sorted out. 
All right, I'm a little bit poisoned. I'm a little bit scratched. I'm a little bit cucumbered, and I'm a little bit in danger of being nibbled on by another honey badger. Just gonna get home. Don't attack. Don't attack. I'm too tired. I'm too tired and weak, and it's not. Ooh. That was dumb. That oh god, he's gonna eat me. He's gonna eat me like he's a freaking lioness chasing Pumba. You turn all that into an animal is hunting me. I gotta, I gotta drop something. I gotta drop something that's weighing me down too much. Do you actually give me anything? I don't know. Uh, look, just take that. Look, I'm sorry I took your ball. Oh, there's two of them. Oh, there's two of them to start time. I'm scared. I'm going home. I'll come back for that. <laughs> that one very valuable rock. First thing in the morning. Ah, shit, there's more. There is something up there. You see that like, it's like a, like a glowy cave or something. I reckon it's that. It's got to be that, right? Surely. It's glowing up the top. It did say... Oh, there's a harpiness right there. Let's cut a little bit of a berth on that one. It did say where, when I, an old mate left the island and left his spyglass behind that I should go to the top of the white-tipped mountain. So I guess I guess that one, because there's no snow caps around here. So I guess that's where i got to go to. That's very interesting. Sometimes you can see better at night time, despite what you might think. Home sweet home in the rocks in the corner. I'm heckin' thirsty and heckin' tired. So hold your horses, please. I should have. I have to place all of you into them. To the bananas, they do give me some water. So I'll eat three of those. Lovely. Got anything else that's going to help me? Bread gives me ten water and five food. All right, I'll eat one of those. Get myself back up and at him again. Cattail tinder. Nice and flammable. Lovely. I was going to say, I could have sworn I had some coconuts in here, but no, nah, I guess not. But look at that. Look at that. Oh, tomorrow morning is going to be an absolute time. You, I need to quickly... No fire starter. All right, hold on a second. I need to grab one of those. You're pretty much cooked, though. And that's about to be spoiled, so I'll eat both of you. Thank you very much. That one needs to be repaired. Then to get my fire started, have a nap, and then tomorrow I can get cracking on actually making this place a home. It took me so long to light fire. It's now morning time again. Maybe I should just let the fire. Ooh, baked cakes. Oh, that's what I needed the eggs for. And I do I have any left? I do actually give me all of you. No, not that one. And give me all of my breadfruit. I am completely exhausted, so I should probably just go to sleep. I need water though. That's something I'm actually really struggling with at the moment. Uh, a couple of nanas should give me some more water and some more breadfruit actually. Nom, nom. There we go. A couple of breadfruits. Get me up and about and a bunch of bananas. Yeah, nah, that'll do. Oh, I actually another breadfruit. No, I didn't want to do that. I want to make myself one of these things first. Takes 40 minutes, but sure, that'll be fine. Get that in here. What do you give me? Some cheeky cake. All right. Ah! Out. Okay, I'm too tired. I'm too tired. Hold on. Just sleep until you feel better again. There you go. There you go. Maximum bloody sleep. 10 hours. There we go. We may have wasted an entire day, but at least we're alive again. Oh, there's an eagle. Hold on. Hold on. Hold up. Oh, I scared you off with a big pointy stick. Are you... Just leaving me in peace. Okay, that's fine. I need to head off this morning to go and get myself some coconuts because I'm heckin' thirsty. There's some coconut palms down there. That rock that I wanted. Ooh. Yeah, look at that. That's definitely a path leading up the mountainside. Uh, that rock, that big boulder I left over with all the honey badges. It's too far away. I'm just going to go get it again. I love that I can see the ladder. I've clasped onto the side of the trunk all the way over there. That was such a good tree, dude. It's opened up so much of the world. Look at it. Look how much I can see now because now I know... Look at that. Coconut palms. Oh, Franklin respawns soon. Lovely. Good morning, everyone, again. It is a bit of a bleak day in the Caribbean, but that's okay, because I am... Oh, there's a hole in me roof. Oh, it's like the regular one with a fire pitcher beat. All right, that's my chimney. That's fine. It's a deliberate hole in the roof. Not a, not a hindrance at all, but I'm inside and ready to sort my life out. I need to get... <laughs> Try to sort my life out. It's way more, more apt on that one. I can hear angry music, but I'm more concerned about just doing this. So I need long sticks, more small sticks, and two liana ropes. I've got all my liana on me. So give me all of those sticks, please. Just all of them. Thank you very much. Take all of that. Put some of my stones away. Okay, so crafting. Where is... Where did it go again? My workbench. Regular workbench. Need the ropes first. Josh, we just discussed this. You... Not Liana. It looks like a rope, but it's for your waist, not for everything else. Where's the rope gone? I'm going to place my workbench all the way over there. I can't actually move any closer to it because I'm completely knackered at the moment. Uh, can you 
running out of space in that one too actually can i reach the far no i can't all right well hold on to that stuff then and that stuff then try and lessen the load a little bit there we go that's all good all right you take all of that gonna take what two hours to build that's all right no tool selected it did say axe didn't it axe uh you you're mostly broken but okay Built you up, regular workbench. The rain has stopped. I can see clearly now the workbench is here. Almost. No, it's not because my axe is broken. God damn it. <laughs> Just last a little longer. There it is. Finally, my regular workbench is up and ready to go. I can make a stone saw. Pretty tool constructing and processing wood has low efficiency, base durability 80, or an obsidian saw. Do we actually have a couple of bits of obsidian I've found around the place? I can finally make a freaking bow. No brainer, absolutely. Please make one of those for me. It takes an hour and 20 minutes. Jeez, the day goes quickly. We're spending all your time making important stuff. Leaf bandolier. Yeah, nah, sure. Why not? Whip up one of you bad boys. It's now drizzling again. <laughs> Jeez, the sunshine didn't last very long, did it? You make me a new spear. Oh, I'm really arming myself to all various parts of me jaw. All of my teeth are going to be armed. All right, where's my obsidian? In you. Give me one of you. Thank you very much. I think an obsidian saw is a better way to do it. Ooh, or obsidian axe. Obsidian axe blade and a long handle. How do I make a long handle? Oh, so I need. I want obsidian for everything. I feel like it's rare, but I still want it. I did see it in here somewhere. Where right, obsidian axe blade is regular workbench and an obsidian. Okay, well I have the regular workbench, so can I make you? Yes. Make that, 54 minutes, so I can make one of those bad boys. Crafting is our level three. Crafting resource can be crafted from a big branch. Okay, alrighty righty then. Big branch, big branch. Where's a big branch gonna be? Oh, I've been guarded by Piggly Wings, damn it. I'm gonna spend the other obsidian I have, make myself that obsidian sword. Whip up you, cannot do that, an animal is hunting me. You better not be, where are you, Pidgey? Come on, Pidgeotto, get over here and use your real weak-ass attack on me. Flip your little, like, I was going to say your, your hair, but your crest one way or the other. How much wax do you reckon Pidgeotto uses? And I reckon it's a bloody lot. You. No tool selected because my... I have you. I have you. Why? Maybe I just... Oh, no suitable hammer. So I need a hammer... Not the axe. I get ya. I get ya. So it's all coming down to those big branches. I've got to go adventuring. Going to quickly make one of these Liana belts as well because it adds one extra weapon slot. Yes, please. Get you in. Nice, nice, nice. Are you actually on me now? You are. So I now have one, two, and three. Yes, bloody please. Which means my bow and my arrows, which are going to be somewhere. In fact, they're already in my ammo slot. Lovely. You can go to like that. And we're ready to go. We're ready to go. I now have a little bit more range. Lovely dovely. I have to make myself some more arrows as well. We've got a couple of them, but that's sick. That's gone real well. Oh, well, with that, it is the middle of the night, but I'm going to call that a very successful day. We've got ourselves a spyglass. We now have some sort of home to put up our feet in. And we have the workbench, which means tomorrow I'm going to be ready to set on out. Go and grab myself those big branches that I need. I did leave one of the branches, I think, actually on the beach, like up here somewhere, didn't I? from cutting down a tree. Mm, no, I need the, I specifically need the big branches so we're going to worth the adventure. We'll go back over, try not to die to pigs and grab all those branches and bring them home for me. So we're going to start making some bigger and better stuff to take on bigger and better tasks. I'll have to come back and continue to be the king of the Caribbean in the next episode because this episode is done. So thank you guys for watching. Most of all, thank you to the patrons of Patreon who made this episode possible. If you like to make sure you hit the like button down below and subscribe to this channel. Follow me on Twitter. If I don't talk to you there first, I'll see you in the next episode. Have a good one.